Hello and welcome to this how to video tutorial. In this video, we're going to show you how to multiply columns in Excel 2016. So we have our units here and unit costs, and if we had a separate column multiplying that out each one, then we wouldn't have to worry so much. But if we just want the complete total over here, all the units and unit costs multiplied correspondingly together and then summed all up, we're going to have to multiply these columns and which means we're going to have to use arrays. So we'll start off and hit equals. And what we want to do here is we want this first one all the way down, control shift down key. And we'll multiply that by this all the way down. And we see here that it has done something weird and given us 284.43, which is not what we want as you can see by the data here. This number is way too small. So Excel has done something weird here, trying to multiply these two columns together. So we'll go ahead and try something different. First we'll go ahead and hit sum, put the parentheses in there, and after we have the parentheses there, we'll try to hit enter, and you can see that it has given us the same value. So we tried multiplying the columns, and we tried summing them all up, but we need to hit control shift enter in the formula bar and it will give us this correct value because now it is considering them as arrays. This has been a How Tech Video Tutorial. Please like, subscribe, comment, and thank you for watching.